Yo. Yep. This is gonna get sick. Hey, what's going on, you beautiful people? Welcome back for another episode of Windbreakers. Today we have episode five, and we're gonna start, I guess, the kind of tournament arc of the show. Because right now it seems like we're gonna get five fights. I don't know if we're gonna get all five in this episode or if it's gonna be stretched out over two episodes. But I'm really excited to get into it. So if you do enjoy it at any point, please make sure to like and subscribe. It really does help me out. And let's get into it. Okay, I'm tired of this recap. Let's get into this five on five already. Oh my god, it's still going. I am excited to finally get into it. Been waiting all week for this spot one on one. They called it five on five, but it's really one on one on one on one on one. Wonder how strong these guys actually are though, because they're still like they've consistently said that Sakura doesn't stand a chance. And Sakura seems pretty strong. Yeah, they're showing how different it is from there and uh Bofurin. Wait, why is Nero there? I didn't think he was fighting. Why is he there? <laughs> yeah, see, why is he there? Oh, he doesn't want to be there and he like volunteered himself essentially to be there oh so he's there to learn okay okay uh, this is taking forever to start a fight already wait why are, why are we fighting at their place like this doesn't make sense I feel like the whole time they were going to this like tournament, they were they. I felt like they were about to get jumped the entire time, and now we're saying that they're going on to their like lair to fight. That's not a good idea. I thought they were gonna go on equal ground. Right now, this is they are outnumbered badly. All right, uh, my disk space ran out. I cleared some things up and we should be good now. So let's get back into it. Sorry for the break. <laughs> Can you make it home? Can you make You're not even the one fighting, buddy. This guy scares me with how, like, happy he is to be in a fight right now. Yeah, I I still feel like they're gonna go all out, even if they don't have to worry about their fights meaning anything. Oh. <laughs> he's not yeah, he's not letting that go first. If that goes first, no matter what happens, there is a fight that's breaking out afterwards. Ooh, so we're gonna get his fight first. We never really got a fight between him and Sakura, so I'm really excited to see how this guy fights. No. Those are fighting words. Literally. Bro, he's like slumped. He doesn't even want to be there right now. So both of these guys are able to break multiple bones with one hit. Okay. Oh, he caught him off. I guess he didn't really. It didn't matter. He took that punch like it was nothing. And this guy doesn't even know it yet. Yep. So much for this guy being a heavy hitter. This guy's nothing compared to him. Yo, the trace from the eyes was sick. Okay, the, the fights in this show, I feel like are going to be incredible. Bro looks demonic at this point. 
with how he's looking over him like that. That's San to you, buddy. I feel like that's got to be one of their best fighters, too. And he just took it and went down. Call my man One Punch Man. This guy's stressing now. But this guy's- he's gassed that this guy's in the fight. <laughs> fight me next. He wants to fight everybody even though that he's only supposed to be fighting Yumi. Of course they're only going to compliment their opponent. He's the one that won and they value power over anything else. It makes sense for them to compliment him. He took him down in one punch. And he took the other guy's punch straight on. <laughs> I love Yumi. Yumi's great. <laughs> that, that handshake did mean something. It did. What is that guy thinking? So it's not weird for anybody in their school to treat people like trash if they're not strong then. And it seems like uh, Nira is the only one that's bothered by that. Yo, he wants another fight. He doesn't want just one. <laughs> yep, that's right. Not until they get thrown off the stage themselves will they understand. Ooh, yo, I've never... Yo, that, that switch up was crazy right there. It was... So, like, stone cold stare to yay. Yo, I'm ready for this one. Yes, yes. <laughs> He's fight his own teammates at this point. Dude, his, his design is my favorite out of everybody's in this show. It is sick. And it's probably just because he reminds me of Krolo from Hunter x Hunter. It is probably simply off that basis. <laughs> he's like, I can tell he's strong by looking at him. Tell me something I don't know. So nobody knows about him then. All they know is that he's got feats on feats. And that he's a gentleman. Just like our boy Krolo. Yeah, this is a man. That's the face of somebody. Yo. Yep. This is going to get sick. Bro's got skill. It's not like he's strong. He's just got straight skill. That's really making me what ha wonder what happened to his eye, because I feel like Suo is somebody who never gets hit. I'm wondering how, like, what happened to Suo's eye now. 
Because there's no way he can move like that and some, so like something bad had to have happened. Or if he's just been covering up just to give himself like a handicap. Yo, this song is sick. This guy doesn't stand a chance. Yeah, this guy's going down. Yeah, he, he, everybody's thinking at least the last guy landed a punch on the dude. Suo's not even getting touched right now. <laughs> no shred of kindness. Yeah, this guy never stood a chance. <laughs> Yo, soccer is crazy. <laughs> we got affected by Sakura. Sakura made him want to step it up. Yeah, he wants to go head to head with Suo because Suo is insane. Yo, look at him, the smile on his face, like it's not even phasing him. I don't even think we've seen Suo up there. I feel like that was the first punch, but it wasn't really a punch. It was like a tap almost. I was going to say, like, I don't think we've seen him throw a punch, but if he can count that as a punch, then yeah, he threw a punch just now. Nah, bro. The... The leader of the school is asleep. He loves fighting and he put him to sleep. Oh my goodness. Oh, I thought he was, I thought he was about to say it's, it's about time to finish it. This guy is losing it. There we go. I feel like that was the first, like, official hit right there. Oh, it wasn't a hit. He stopped it right before he hit him. Oh, this is real torment right here. They said he was tormenting him before, but now this is different. This is just different. He made him see his own downfall without even touching him. Yo, this is a different kind of torment. I feel like this is the first, uh, we're gonna, he's gonna forfeit. Oh, so their side just conceded. They didn't even finish the fight. He's not even gonna have to lose the fight to get kicked out. Ooh, okay, this uh, this is crazy. Becoming oh, so he's not able to empathize. That's why he's saying, "Why don't we both become adults?" Yo, Suo is my favorite character. Nire is, a, is second, but Suo is awesome. So I'm guessing we're going to get uh, Sakura's, uh, Yumi's, and the other guy, the Stomach Egg guys fight in the next episode, which I am super excited for. And if you did enjoy at any point, please consider liking and subscribing. It really does help me out. And I will see you in the next one.